Hello everyone, I'm Zihan, an undergraduate intern at UCLA Design Research, and I'm presenting our work on Immoglass, an end-to-end AI-enabled wearable platform for enhancing self-awareness of emotional health. This work is finished in collaboration with Yu Fei Wu, Yang Zhang, and Anthony Chen. Emotional health is an important part of people's overall health, which allows us to work productively and cope with the stresses of everyday life. There are many emotional health monitoring systems to support people's emotional health, many of which are in the form of wearables or smartphones. However, most of prior works have only explored laboratory settings, and a few platforms are yield towards end users in everyday lives, or providing personalized emotional suggestions to promote self-regulation. Furthermore, due to a lack of self-awareness of emotional health, most people do not pay much attention to their emotions, not to mention having the motivation to use monetary tools every day. Thus, they miss the chance to detect their emotional disorder in the early stages. To address these issues, we present Immoglass, an end-to-end -end platform consisting of facial expression detection-enabled eyeglasses and a mobile application that can provide personalized guidance to promote emotional health awareness. There are five channels through which emotions can be detected. This includes speech, test, facial expression, body gestures, and physiological states. We focus on leverage facial expressions as direct indicators. Facial expression have shown significant collaborations with emotions and have been widely used in emotion-related diagnosis. In this case, we built a type of camera-mounted glasses it can capture facial expression easily. To find the optimal angle of the camera, we conducted a pilot study and built a small data set. Then we trained the small convolution model, used the convolution network to visualize the reconstruction features, and selected the angle with the most useful features. To improve the robustness of our system in and out of lab environment, we constructed three data sets from 15 participants covering emotion card imitation, various lightning conditions, and enhance the neutralness of facial expression. We pre-processed the input images to correct the illumination and the position before feeding them into the deep learning model. Then we developed the deep learning models with attention mechanisms for facial expression recognition based on pre-processed data sets. For the basic Immoglass app, the users can start or stop recording or examine their emotion statistic reports in a week or day in various visualizations. They can also check the pre-minute data for each selected hour or view a recorded emotion diary. Some general guidance and suggestions are also available in the app. To validate the performance of the Immoglass device and the first app, we recruited the same 15 participants for three-day out-of-lab study where each participant run in glass at least three hours a day of that lab. Participants need to self-report their emotions every 15 minutes, which we use as ground truth labels. In the middle of the study, we gain the feedback from the first seven participants and designed a second Immoglass app for the other eight participants. Firstly, we found that most participants had an incomprehensive understanding of emotional health Thus, we need to educate users about this concept. We added a page to introduce what emotional health is and is not. Secondly, we found that our app needs to go beyond visualization. To be specific, it needs to help users fully record and connect the events to form a clear and a complete mapping of emotion triggers, emotion, and the bodily response. Thus, we added the emotion diary for recording emotion triggers when checking daily reports. That is, a user can select a certain period on the emotion fluctuation graph to target particular emotions. And an extra prompt will guide the users to write a description for this event and upload corresponding pictures if needed. Thirdly, we discovered that we can help users regulate their emotions by evoking the positive triggers of the user themselves. For this reason, the Help Remind page was added to support users by reminding them of activities that happened during the previous positive emotions. 
that we found it is necessary to build the user's trust in emotion detection. Some participants mentioned that their trust in the results depended on whether the device feedback matched their expectation during the period when they knew exactly what their status was. Thus, we added a real-time detection page to allow users to check what Emoglas think their emotion is around this very moment. Finally, Emoglas aims at enhancing people's awareness of their emotions, which is critical for maintaining the emotional health. However, some participants were unsure about the difference between these two concepts. In this case, we found we need to connect these two concepts by providing the self-reflecting feature, which presents guidance for users to further perform self-diagnosis of their emotional health. Then we developed a redesigned application to the remaining eight participants and collected feedback from them, while being praised for some reasons such as the detection mechanism is transparent, the privacy concerns of Immoglass still exist. Participants found Immoglass effectively helping to reflect the emotions and being informative and helpful, and some of the participants are willing to use Immoglass for the daily use. The technical evaluation results for facial expression recognition in the auto lab study is given in the figure. The average accuracy across 15 participants reaches 73%. To sum up, our paper presents Emoglass and to end the wearable platform consisting of emotion detection glasses and a mobile app. After conducting a 3D out of lab study, we report findings based on which we discuss these recommendations for future work on sensing and enhancing awareness of emotional health. Thank you for listening to me and we're happy to take questions.